Hare Krishna everyone, this is Nitya Kishore from the Maya Purvasis and today I try to show you inside our beautiful temple in West Bengal, India, trying to explain to you the deities in the altar, okay? This is our main altar, one of the biggest in the world. The main deity is Radha Madhava in front of you. Krishna is black and Radharani is white. This is our main deity, Radha Madhava. The side, the right side, there are four gopis in the left side also for gopis look radharani so beautiful this is a kadashi day so the deity dresses in red here you can see one two three four gopis tunga vidya chitra champakalata lalita four and then you go to another sudevi ranga devi induleka vishaka four eight gopis radha krishna they are tall more or less one meter seventy centimeter they're very tall every day the deities are dressing different clothes and their clothes are amazing so they have clothes they have jewelry and fresh garlands so every day at 7 a.m. the altar open and the devotees um, sing mantras for the deities. So nice, isn't it? You see, there are 5,000 at least guests every day coming to Mayapur. 5,000 guests per day. This is no festival sign where there, when there is no festival 5000 when there is festival you can have 30000 35000 70000 100000 people come one day to visit this is the main temple room and we are going to see uh, the other side where are the other deities of Panchatatwa? But for a while, you will listen to the kirtan.
are having darshan or we are seeing the deity of Lord Nrsimha Dev, the incarnation of Krishna, half lion, half man. This adoration makes the worshipper completely free of any kind of fear. It's very, very powerful. And Nrsimha Dev got installed in Mayapur Dam to protect Mayapur Dam for some attacks that we had in the past. Some Dakoids were sometimes invading, trying to fight, and uh, so then the, the management decided to bring Lord Nrsimha Dev and Pralada Maharaj to protect Sri Mayapur Dam. After Nrsimha Dev's installation, no more attacks happened. Every difficulty, every prob problem any devotee has, it's just he or she just come and pray to Lord Nisimha Dev for his protection, his forgiveness, his understanding. Lord Nisimha Dev is very dear for all my poor devotees. <laughs> Inside the temple, we have uh, um, many preaching activities going on. Book distribution, japa distribution, explanation, uh, puja. So then uh, we got the guests engaged, Hare Krishna, we got the guests engaged in devotional service. You just saw this lady, she's from China. There are at least 50 countries represented from different devotees from all over the world inside Maya Prodam. It's a real international community. So now we just see Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, you're having darshan of the Pancha Tattva. In front of you, this is Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, the Nitananda Prabhu, and Advaita Charya. Because Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu appeared in Maya Prodam, the main deity here is should be the Panchatattva. So, actually, the Panchatattva will be the main deity of the new temple. But here, it got installed after Radha Madhava. So that is the second and Panchatattva stand in the second temple room. It's called Panchatattva Temple Room. The system is the same, fresh flowers, beautiful decoration, beautiful, amazing clothes made with love. That's, that's the most important part of the worship. Only opulence is not enough, must be made with love. You see Lord Chaitanya with many fresh garlands, turbans, these are devotees, praying, visitors from all over India, from all over the world. They all come to have the mercy and the darshan of the deities of Mayapur. And now um, we will see the boys from Gurukul. They, they are different ages, you see? 8 years old, 10 years old, 14 years old, 15 years old. They learn in Gurukul how to be priests. And uh, it's part of their studies to come to the temple. It's not only theor theor theory they learn in the school, they come to the temple and they practice. You see, the big one is helping the small one. And another Gurukul system only where um, the big ones take care of the small ones. Now you are seeing again Radha Madhava, the Pujari, the merciful, merciful Pujari. Pujari is always giving sweets, always giving garlands, 
give my prasad to everybody. The whole day long, they're very patient, they're very happy, they mercifully give to others the Mahaprasad of the deities because they know people come from so far to have Radha Madhava Darshan so they make sure they, that they, they get Mahaprasad so wonderful red dresses are very beautiful Tulsi Dev Maharani is also there now you are again see from closer Radha Chishu Radha Madhava and the Astasaki. The kirtan is going on. This kirtan is continue from 4.30 a.m. in the morning. The whole day we have kirtan. Every day, the whole day, never stop. So, Mayapur is auspicious in all respects. Kirtan, Prashada distribution, Puja, lecture. So much auspiciousness all around. So anybody who comes and can feel the atmosphere, the transcendental atmosphere created by the devotional service that people are performing in Sri Maya Pradham by their, their prayers, their mantras, their instruments, all in the transcendental platform. this video I hope uh, you could enjoy the darshan and the kirtan and uh, we just have one request for you very simple please like share and subscribe subscribe button with notification okay the bell so we can you can get uh, when we do new videos you can be notified Although if you don't ring the bell you cannot be notified when we do uh, new videos. Mayapur Dham is super special. The Mayapur Vasis uh, is a team of musicians, artists. Uh, we, we created and we perform music, uh, drama and uh, traditional Indian dance. 
we need your support please like subscribe and share with your friends enlighten them inspire them to spiritual life this is our objective this is what we are doing here right now we want to inspire you to the remembrance of the holy dumb and the holy name of krishna so you help us by like share and subscribe um we our aim is, is to have at least 1000 subscribers on youtube so we can go live on youtube too with our programs okay please leave your feedback comment we want to see what do you want what do you like to see in mayapur what do we like to know about mayapur Dham? please tell us write to us write your comment so then we can do it for you look at the kid he's in ecstasy that's mayapur mayapur is a place for for dance place for dancing and uh, chanting look he's ecstatic yeah radhanatha maharaj said that mayapur is a place for dancing singing nothing else <laughs> okay so see you in our next production Hare Krishna